The deputy head of Hamas Political Bureau has told Al Jazeera that negotiations over a truce in Gaza have completely broken down. He said there would be no further exchange of captives until the end of the war. Earlier, Israel pulled negotiators from its intelligence agency Mossad out of Qatar, which has been mediating ceasefire efforts. The official and final stance of the movement of Hamas is that there will be no exchange of captives until the end of the aggression and a comprehensive and permanent ceasefire. We, the Hamas movement, declared from the beginning that it is not a maneuver, deception or anything else that the foreign prisoners who arrived to Gaza on October 7th were not a target and that we were ready to release them without conditions. Women and children who are held captives were not our targets either. They arrived in Gaza due to the exceptional circumstances and we were also ready to conclude this matter in exchange of the release of our women and children held in the occupation forces prisons. There was supposed to be an international commitment unrelated to the exchange regarding the relief of our people. Israel claims that here are many women and children that are still held captives, although we have exchanged all what we have. And if there are some cases that we are not aware of, we are ready to conduct investigations. The remaining prisoners in Gaza are soldiers and civilian men who have served in the Israeli army. Therefore, there are currently no negotiations on the issue of captives until the aggression stops.